hurricane force wind causing damage for hundreds of miles. In just a few short hours, a derecho can certainly leave its mark. A derecho is a widespread long-lived windstorm. To be classified as one, it has to cause a swath of damage 250 miles or more, with widespread wind gusts of 58 miles per hour or stronger, and several wind gusts up to 75 miles per hour or stronger. But how do they form? The derecho begins as a single or small cluster of thunderstorms. It quickly evolves into a line of storms ushered along by powerful upper-level winds. These upper-level winds are crucial because they keep the line of storms going. Another critical element is what's called a cold pool. This is a bubble of cooler air in the middle of a thunderstorm. That cool air is more dense, causing it to rapidly sink. It results in those damaging wind gusts. In a derecho, this cold pool is supported by rain cooling the air and by those strong upper-level winds. And that's why the damaging wind gusts can be so expansive. Roughly 70% of derechos happen between May and August. They feed off the warm, humid weather conditions. A derecho is hard to predict because several subtle weather features have to align in order to produce one. That's why you should always be prepared for severe weather. For Weather Nation, meteorologist Steve Blitcher.